moment you gave birth to God the Word, true Theotokos, we magnified you. In the name of the Lord, Master, Christ. Through the prayers of our holy Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, have mercy upon us and and author of all creation, who in thy boundless tender mercy has sent down thine only begotten Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, to the salvation of the world. And through his holy cross has torn off the handwriting of our sins, and thereby triumphed over the princes and dominions of darkness. Do thou, O Master, who lovest mankind, accept these prayers of thanksgiving and supplication even from us sinners. Deliver us from every deadly and dark transgression and from all the visible and invisible enemies that seek to do us harm. Fill our flesh with the fear of thee, and let not our hearts incline to evil words or thoughts, but wounds our souls with thy love that ever gazing upon thee, guided by thy light and beholding thee, the eternal life, whom no man can approach. We may send up unceasing praises and thanks to thee, the Father without beginning, together with thy only begotten Son, and thy most holy, good, and life-giving Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Cur keul ar Amisa da disa da spilisa sulisa, acta maranista upuniti upunisam de. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the peace from above and for the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have state of the holy churches of God, and for the unity of the faithful, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for this holy house, and for those who enter with faith, reverence, and fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord Lord, Metropolitan Deacon, our Archbishop Paul, the Honorable Priest to the Diaconate of Christ, for all the clergy and the whole people of God, let us pray to the Lord. For this God who kept in man his president, all civil authorities, and for the armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for these cities, for every city and country place, and for the faithful dwelling in them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For favorable weather and abundance of the fruits of the earth and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord suffering for captives and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord for our deliverance from all affliction, anger, danger, and need, let us pray to the Lord. Lord Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord have mercy. You are most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, Ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee, Lord. Amen to Shue Nishen, the Kovali Tidiba, Ativita Tat Vani Stesiva, Namisa Zadisa, the Smidisa Sulisa, Asta Maradista, Uniti Uk Unisam de.
mercy on us and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Raging our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God.
to your spirit. A prokemenon in the fourth tone. He makes his angel spirits and his ministers a flame of fire. Righteous shall rejoice in the Lord and shall hope in him. Hear my voice, O God, when I pray unto thee. shall rejoice in the Lord. The reading is from the epistle of the Holy Apostle Paul to the Colossians. Let us attend. Brethren, being dead in your sins and the uncircumcision of your flesh, he has made alive together with him having forgiven you all trespasses, having wiped out the handwriting of ordinances that was against us, which was contrary to us. And he has taken it out of the way, having nailed it to the cross, having disarmed principalities and powers. He made a public show of them, triumphing over them in it. Therefore, let no man judge you in meat or in drink or in regard to a holy day, or the new moon, or of the Sabbath days, which are a shadow of things to come. But the substance is of Christ. Let no one cheat you of your reward, taking delight in false humility and worship of angels, intruding into those which he has not seen, vainly puffed up by his fleshly mind, not holding fast to the head from which all the body, nourished and knit together by joints and ligaments, grows with increase of God. Therefore, if you died with Christ from the basic principles of the world, why, as though living in the world, are you subject to regulation? And to your spirit, alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Praise the Lord, all his angels. Praise him, all his power. For he spoke and they came into being. He commanded and they were created. Son of Man will also be assigned to this generation. The Queen of the South will rise up in the judgment along with the people of this generation, and she will condemn them, for she came from the ends of the earth to hear the wisdom of Solomon, and behold, someone greater than Solomon is here. The people of Nineveh will stand up in the judgment with this generation, 
and they will condemn it because they, re they repented at the preaching of Jonah, and behold, someone greater than Jonah is here. No one who has lit a lamp puts it in a cellar or under a basket. Instead, it is placed on a stand so that those who come in may see the light.
Prince Paul, Archbishop of Chicago and the Midwest, may the Lord God remember in his kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. And you, and all Orthodox Christians, may the Lord God remember you in his kingdom, always, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Let us come be our prayer unto the Lord. Lord have mercy. For the precious gifts now offered, let us pray to the Lord. Lord For this holy house and for those who enter with faith, reverence, and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. For our deliverance from all affliction, anger, danger, and need, let us pray to the Lord. O God, by thy grace, let the whole day may be perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless, let us ask of the Lord, an angel of peace, a faithful guide, a guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord, pardon and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us ask of the Lord. Ask of the Lord that we may complete the remaining time of our life with peace and repentance. Let us ask of the Lord a Christian ending to our life faith as blameless and peaceful and a good defense before the great judgment seat of Christ. Let us ask, commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed, and glorious Lady Theotokos, ever Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and one another and all our life unto Christ our God. To thee. Through the compassions of thine only begotten Son, with whom thou art blessed, together with thine all holy, good and life giving Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Peace be unto all. Let us attend. 
Holy Spirit shall be with all of you. Let us lift up our hearts. We lift them up unto the Lord. Let us give thanks unto the Lord. It is meet and right to worship the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit.
and upon these gifts here spread forth, and make this bread to be the most pure body of thy Christ. Amen. And that which is in this cup to be the most precious blood of thy Christ. Amen. Making the change by thy Holy Spirit. Amen. 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 That they may be for those who partake for the purification of soul, the remission of sins, for the communion of thy Holy Spirit, for the fulfillment of the kingdom of heaven, for boldness towards thee, but not for judgment or for condemnation. And again we offer unto thee this reasonable worship for those who have fallen asleep in the faith, ancestors, fathers, mothers, patriarchs, prophets, apostles, preachers, evangelists, martyrs, confessors, ascetics, for every righteous spirit may be perfect in faith, especially for our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady Theotokos, and ever Virgin Mary, Spirit. I've been remembered all the saints again, yet again in me. 
I believe, O Lord, and I confess that thou art truly the Christ, Son of the living God, who came into the world to save sinners, of whom I am the first. I believe also that this is truly thine own most holy word, and this is truly thine own precious blood. Therefore I pray, have mercy upon me, and forgive my transgressions, both voluntary and involuntary. Of word and of deed, committed in knowledge and
perfectly partake of Forsake us not who put our hope in thee. Give peace to thy world, to thy churches, to thy priests, to all those in civil authority, and to all thy people. For all good giving and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from thee, the Father of lights. And unto thee do we send up glory, thanksgiving, and worship, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Ages of ages. Oh, Lord, 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 Lord,
Christ, our blood and our sure hope. Glory to Thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Christ, our true God, through the prayers of his own pure and blameless mother, and the supplication of the holy, glorious, and all audible apostles by the power and protection of the honorable, bodiless powers of heaven through the intercessions of our holy fathers and mothers among the saints, whom we commemorate on this day, and especially our venerable father, Gabriel, confessor, and fool for Christ and Sketa, of John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints, have mercy upon us and save us, for he alone is good and the lover of mankind. Thy servant. 
the healing of my soul and body. Grant me tears of repentance and confession that I may glorify you all the days of my life. For you are blessed and greatly glorified forever. Amen. Lord, now let us thou thy servant depart in peace according to thy word. For my eyes have seen thy salvation, which thou hast prepared before the face of all people. A light to be light in the gentle Gentiles, and to be the glory of thy people Israel. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Master, pardon our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Mercy upon us and save us, for he alone is good and the lover of us. 